Hey everyone, I'm Rosie and welcome back to my channel. A year ago, I made this exact video where I showcased every collage that I'd made in the past year. And I thought it'd be fun if we did that again today. So I collected every collage that I've made that I still own in the past year. And I'm excited to take a little trip down memory lane and look through all these collages again and to share them with you guys. So let's jump into it. So I did try to organize my collages in chronological order but these are all the ones that don't fit in a nice little stack. They're either 3D or framed. So I think we should start here. These collages were inspired by this frame. All the ones with glass are gonna be really hard to film. Found this frame at the thrift store. This is a pretty recent video and I think these two monkeys came out great. Here's the most recent collage I've done, our 3D soup bird. This was the most recent video I've done. If you missed it, check it out. This was the first 3D collage I ever made. I call it the dream. We have this woman sleeping in this field of butterflies behind a mountain range. It's just a really fun one and it was really cool experimenting with the 3D and I've loved sort of incorporating that into other collages. Like this collage, we got this, I think it's a chameleon tail. We got some 3D going on here and we have some animals coming out of the tail. I love how colorful this one is. Then we have the art I made for my Crocs. I made these really small framed collages to wear on my Crocs. This was a really fun one and I, <laughs> they're so silly and I love wearing them on my Crocs and they turned out great. Then we have my vinyl record collage where I made this mountainscape. Someone commented and said, this must be rock music, which I thought was really funny, <laughs> really funny pun. I also want to collage on a record again, so look forward to that because I'm definitely going to do it again. The next three pieces are framed because I actually have these hanging in my own house because I like them so much. There's this car driving into a camera on this uh, sort of beach landscape, which I think turned out really nice. Oh, this was a thrift store makeover that I took a print that was already framed in this frame and added the mushrooms and the birds. This was a really fun one, and I think this turned out great. One of my favorite collages I've ever made. The last framed piece we have is kind of a long one. We have this lighthouse keeper who's overlooking his lighthouse to look at a mermaid. And I love this piece because I was able to incorporate four different backgrounds. And I just think it turned out really beautiful, and it fits so nicely in this frame. Now let's move on to this huge stack of collages. And I think the first couple are ones that I didn't make in videos. So we first have this guy who's getting measured for pants on the streets of New York. I really love that one. And this guy who's screaming because the hot sauce was too hot. We've got this Tabasco bottle and this guy making a crazy face. Love this one too. Then we have this one. I don't think this is even glued. We have this lady bringing flowers to a greenhouse in the distance. The colors in this one are really nice, this bluish green. Yeah, I just, this is a nice one. I don't know why it's not glued. I don't know, didn't get to it. Oh, we got this one with this kid running away <laughs> from a CD. This one makes me chuckle every time. All right, now we're starting to get into videos. This is one from, I made really small collages. I don't think I have any of the other collages I made in that video. I don't know where they are, but they are not here. <laughs> then this is from the dollar store challenge. I took this pie uh, packaging and these flowers. That's kind of a fun one. Oh, Taco Granny. We can't forget about her. She is the best. Love this collage. And then the weirdest one from that bunch, we got the tea ladies with the flying sausage. <laughs> I don't know, you just, you make some weird things and that's okay, I love it. Uh, oh, the next two I made in the same video where we took some glasses and then made, put different scenes within the glasses then put them in a landscape. Fun little concept and I love how both of these turned out. This was from a one source challenge from a Nat Geo magazine. I think we stole Yo-Yo Ma's arms and his cello and put it on this jellyfish for a little underwater concert. This is such a beautiful collage and I just, it makes me so happy to look at. And we got some raccoons chilling in an outdoor living room. This piece, it turned out really fun and I love it. And we got the waterfall faucet, this waterfall coming out of a faucet. This. <laughs> This is a really silly one, but I love that. What's this? Oh, an octopus in a living room. That's a pretty fun one. I think that was in the same video as this uh, family picnic in a salad dish. I think this one <laughs> turned out really fun. I really love how 
small they look in the salad. I love this collage. Ooh, the first one I added embroidery to. This was, this is such a beautiful collage. Oh man, I love it so much. Oh, our little seashell ladies, our little seaside town with the seashells. This is a, <laughs> this is a cute little silly little scene. The collage where I used all those eyeballs. This is a fun one. I love the trippy background behind the eyes. There's some cool things happening in this collage, especially this cutout area from the background. That's a really cool technique that I should do more often. That's really cool. This is one of the only collages I've ever made with a map. We got these climbers climbing up the side of New Hampshire. This is a cool collage. It's too, it's a little bit too big to fit in the frame, but really love that one. Oh, this one and the next one were from a one source challenge from a Nat Geo magazine. This one is this like picnic happening uh, in a construction zone, fun one. And then the shark in the neighborhood. That one turned out, I mean, surprisingly cool. For one source challenge, these were both really great. This was from when Dana and Felicia bought me supplies. I don't have the other collage I made in that video, but this one, the thanks come again penguins. And I will note that this collage, I'm gonna to try to show, show it on camera, has a lot of bubbling in the background. I get comments, people asking me how to avoid that. And you know, sometimes it happens to me too. Just sometimes you get unlucky and you get really bubbly backgrounds, that's okay. I made this landscape with feathers and this is kind of different than my normal collages, but it really turned out beautiful. And I love how I kept the background pretty light and kept it blank. Turned out great. Toothbrush collage, this little field of toothbrushes. I forgot about this collage. It is so fun. We got the little bugs like they're on flowers. Oh, that is such a fun one. Oh yeah, this skull with the <laughs> paintbrushes and the candlesticks on this weird scene. This is kind of an interesting collage. Definitely not the best, but there's some cool stuff happening in it. Oh, this is the one I was gonna draw all over with Posca's and then chickened out, but absolutely love the collage. Glad I didn't do anything to it. This is the collage I did end up doing with Posca's and more like I just, it was just I drew on an image and I don't know, turned out fun. Um, I haven't really used Pos Posca's since, but I do have them if I need them. This is the collage I made for Halloween. I love how paranormal it is. The abstract collage. I definitely don't think this is sort of the best abstract collage I could have made, but it was a fun experiment and it turned out all right. Oh yeah, the fish coming out of the TV with the high heels, the TV with the high heels. I think this is a really fun one. Really, really fun. We got the ladies in the wine bottles. This was a fun collage to make too. Finding the right ladies to put in the wine bottles. This one also isn't glued, it's just taped down. I'm not really sure why I never glued it, but that's okay. It's still a great collage nonetheless. Our paper doll group. So we made, these are, now we're getting to sort of recent videos. Uh, these, man, these are so good. I absolutely love these. We got the strawberry girl dancing on a rooftop garden. We got space girl with her space coat and a fish man. This was such a fun series. Oh man, so good. What was this? Oh, scraps collage. This is the collage I made for with scraps. Uh, it's so, it's so ridiculous. Oh my God. And I kind of had forgotten that I even made this. Wow, okay. <laughs> so funny. What is this? Oh yeah, the house with the flowers coming out of it. I made that in the same video as the, uh, what are these, jellyfish coming down this uh, outside sort of restaurant cafe thing. Both these are sort of have this weird bend to it. I think I should stick these under a book. They're a little, uh, little warped. The Valentine's Day collages. These were a really fun little bunch and that such a cool concept. Got this living room. Well, I guess this whole house, dollhouse in the heart. We got the couple in the heart. And we got the beach scene in the heart. Such a fun little group. So this is the second collage I did embroidery on. So we have this uh, 
cable car thing going between one mushroom group to another mushroom group and then we got the little embroidery string as the little cable that's a fun one i this is you know it's okay but i kind of like it oh and i think we made this fish collage in that same video we got the fish in the living room the colors in this one are just they work so well together this is a really really good collage and last but not least we got cabbage fisherman this is the most recent collage I made. We got this guy fishing cabbage out of a field and uh, such a fun collage. So that was every collage that I've made in the past year that I still own. There are a couple that I don't own anymore, but I don't think it's that many. And when I look at the table, there I feel like there aren't that many collages here, but in actuality, there are a lot of pieces of art here. This has been a crazy year. I've made so much art. And I absolutely love all of them. They're all my babies. But I would love to know which collage is your favorite and which one is your least favorite. I'd love to know. I know that I've done some kind of experimenting here and there. And no, not every collage is a winner. That's okay. This is just a fun art journey. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. And I'll see you next Thursday for another collage video. Bye.